My dinner with Hervé is such a delight. It came out of nowhere. Journalist Danny Tate interviews Hervé Villachez, who was the last person to interview the French actor before his suicide. Sasha Gervaisi is the real life interviewer of Hervé and he also directed the film and he worked on the script with Peter Dinklage, who plays Hervé. So you could say this is a passion project for both of them and it really does show. So maybe it might just be too much of personal investment for Sasha because his own story becomes a bit too prominent over Hervé's in places. And we've got Jamie Dornan playing Danny Tate who is doing what he can to remove that memory of Fifty Shades and he has made all the right choices in doing this film. What a powerful performance by Jamie Dornan. Jamie Dornan is back people! The Jamie Dornan that I loved in Once Upon a Time and The Fall. But not maliciously but pretty much everything and everyone gets forgotten about in this film because of Peter Dinklage playing Hervé. The plane, the plane! Peter Dinklage really did understand Hervé and he gives us that opportunity to understand too. He just invites us in willingly, he's so open in this performance and he just oozes Hervé, it's his voice, his mannerisms. If this wasn't a TV movie, I'd certainly say he deserves an Oscar nomination for his performance. He transported me. He portrayed Hervé fabulously. I smiled all the way through my dinner with Hervé thanks to Peter Dinklage and hearing his story is such a fun one but ultimately it does end on a very sad note. Now it's your time to leave your thoughts and feelings in the comment box below. What did you think of My Dinner with Hervé or have you seen it yet? Let me know. Please do like the video and subscribe if you like the channel. Thanks for watching. So maybe too much of a personal investment, investment, and Sean Connery.